What's up guys? Here at Silver State, it is 7.21 a.m. They actually started 20 minutes ago. I'm running late, but I plan on releasing a part two of the life of an RC racer documentary, but I'm gonna scratch that. It was an idea I had, and it's actually probably two to three times more work to make a video like that, and we literally got less than half the amount of people that typically watch my videos, watch that video. So I appreciate you guys who gave me good feedback, who really liked that type of video. However, I'm not gonna continue with the series. We're just gonna go old school vlog style. It seems more. It seems like more people like that style of vlogging and that style of YouTube video. So we're gonna change it up. Life of an RC racer is done. Thanks a lot for watching. We're going back to old school vlog style. Sorry if you guys liked it and I teased you with it. Maybe I'll do it again. But for now, we're going old school. So enjoy the video. to lose my helper if you don't have another person helping you and you're carrying three ogos you have to get creative and in my case i have like luggage straps to strap them together but i think i'm gonna have someone picking me up and this time i'm with some melissa staying back for now she'll be out thursday thursday she'll be out in two days so Wow, that was crazy. I just ran into someone who, who saw me and uh, knows me from the channel. A random person at the airport knows me from the channel. That's pretty awesome. He's not going to Silver State. He's actually just <laughs> hanging out, laying over, and he goes, I heard your voice, and I knew you were Mark Santa Maria. So that was, that was really cool. Uh, Danny, if you're watching, big shout out, bud. Thanks for coming by and saying hi. My driver's all dressed up, ready to go. Dude, I don't know, just throw that one in there. All right, guys, I just made it. Uh, but just like last year, I just got here. We dropped all my bags off. We're gonna go down to the track. I'm gonna show you guys the track. I'm gonna go claim my pit spot, and then we're gonna go hit night on town. Big shout out to Barry. Barry was already in Vegas, and he came and picked me up from the airport. So thanks, man. You're Wait a minute, almost forgot my freaking hotel key. We're rolling out. We just saw Carlos. Carlos, super fast techno driver. Actually, I hope he's still running techno. You still run techno, right? I do. Okay. <laughs> I was hoping I didn't mess that up this way, dude. Walking to the track. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Hey, how's it going, man? How are you, dude? How are yourself? Good. It's Mr. Tyler Brown. <laughs> Thanks, dude. That was Mr. Promotion Tires. Promotion Tires and JT Bearings. The guy who just passed us. We gotta walk down that way. Almost just took Barry out. <laughs> Almost just took Barry out with the camera. I keep trying to get Just trying to. We got Mr. DC, DC. Yes, sir, baby. <laughs> Dylan Caldwell, he's a local, kind of local. Yeah, 
close he's like enough. he's like five hours south of us, but it's crazy because these guys are from Texas. We're all in Vegas. All those guys. Or he's not from Texas anymore. He he moved. Yeah, he, he's he he betrayed us. Okay, we gotta catch up to Barry. Barry just completely left us. Dang, it's like that, Barry. Are oh, you trying to catch Tim Massey? It's kind of cool. Like we just get here. Oh, there's there's the the Joey Christensen. What's up, bud? How are you, man? <laughs> You're in there. <laughs> <laughs> this is the track builder, the promoter, everything. Yes, my boy Mark. How, how are you, dude? Everything's good. You doing good? Glad you're here. Thanks, man. Good See seeing you, you bud. Later. Kind of smells like poo in here, but it's because there's a rodeo over here. We're not going to look at the track yet, even though Barry's cheating. You can look to the, to the left and it. see the track, but I'm like out of breath. That was a long walk. They have a bar here? They have a bar yeah, the bar. there's a bar while you're racing. It's open the whole entire time. There, here is the pitting area. Oh, there's the the techno guy, Mr. Techno owner and team manager. We'll say hi to Matt real quick. Hey, how are you, sir? Doing good? Doing good, yeah. Doing good. Yeah. Good, job. good job. Bringing in all the chairs, huh? Just getting everything set up. Nope. Danny, how are you, sir? Hey. Doing good? Good, how are you? Good, man. All right, I, I have a spot here somewhere. We just got to find it. No, no. Looking. No. I'm here somewhere, guys, I promise. I think I have two spots here, actually. So we're just going to have to pick the best spot. How's it going, guys? How are you? Good, now that we're out of the truck. <laughs> I'm good that I'm off the plane. All right, I don't think I'm this far. I think i got to go back. I got this pit spot, and I got that one over there. I have to find out who to sell out on. I end up selling out on James. <laughs> so, this is so, someone's going to lose. Someone's gonna, it, it was you, bud. Sorry. Uh, but this is the entire techno area. This is really cool. This is just how it was last year. What makes it worse is he said <laughs> they, he couldn't trust us to get, to get in the pit spot. That's true. I, James might be already kind of feeling it. I, I feel like James is on another level already. Oh, um, I'm, I'm, I'm on <laughs> Usually Mugen pits over here. There's TNR over here. We'll do a full tour of this place on race day, of course. But, man, I'm just excited to be here having a blast. Look, this guy's just driving up in here. But well, we're going to go see Mr. Brian Eider because that's my boy. HCRC, H, God dang it, I always mess it up. HRCR. This is my boy, Evan. Why aren't you been over there with us? HRCR. Oh, that's right. So he's from Canada, right? Canada, right? I met him last year at Silver State. My boy. What's up, man? Good to see you, bud. Look at how clean his car is. Check that out. My car's not that clean. Brand new bodies on both of his eight skills. All right, we got to go say hi to. To Brian, I got. I keep getting distracted. How you doing, buddy? How, how, do I, how, I want a hug, man. I want a hug, dude. <laughs> oh man, that was that was a lot of hugs. How are you, dude? I'm good, buddy. Doing good. This is uh, Brian with HRC. How's it going? R. I always mess it up. It's okay. Sorry, buddy. It's okay. Well, it's good People seeing you, bud. Yeah, likewise. Yeah, Travis, how's it going, bud? How's it going? These guys, crazy fast. You run pro, right? No. <laughs> Come on, dude. Uh, pro, pro last. <laughs> pro last. Look at his cool body. It's like a vintage Toyota look. That looks pretty sweet. Hey, how are them bullets holding up? Dude, the bullets are amazing. Yeah. Yeah. No more heat problems. No. Shut her down. I got Shut them on all my cars now. Yeah. yeah. Look, they got their fist scales down there. I think Brian said he was going to let me. Uh... <laughs> yeah, the YouTube guy. I think Brian said he was going to let me drive those this weekend, so we'll get to drive that. All right, guys. Sorry. I got a little excited when I got here because I saw so many people I haven't seen in a long time, so I'd say a lot of highs. Uh, no, no, were you going to record for me? I was. He, he was giving me I, my... No, I'm, I was I'm trying good. to help you out. This, no, this is how I do so it. So you can I, walk I, free. I feel good. This is where my comfort zone is, recording myself. <laughs> we're going to check out the track really quick. Actually, we'll go up on the stand and check out the track up there. But it's crazy because it's like all these guys... It's like family away from home. We, we fly out to Vegas. And we know everybody. It's, it's just such a cool feeling. That's what's great about the, the hobby. All right, the track is... A lot bigger than last time. Oh man, the music's gonna mess up my video. We gotta hurry up. Get away from the music, Mark. What's up, dude? How's it going, it's Mr. Jimmy Babcock? He's the uh, the announcer, but here's the track. Looks. Look at all the elevation back there. That looks amazing. But yeah, this is a lot bigger than last time. Last time, it kind of cut off right here. I would say it's 30% bigger. The track looks amazing. Wow. I'm gonna go enjoy myself. We just got here. We're gonna kick the uh, the trip off right. We're gonna go hit Fremont Street, hang out, do the Vegas stuff, and freaking sing. Great race.
Guys, we might have made a rookie mistake for a Vegas trip, which is going too hard on the first night. My God, look how red my eyes are. So we got in around 4.30, and it's 6.30 right now. I ended up taking like maybe a 30 minute power nap. I was just gonna try to stay up the whole time, but I was just too tired. Um, but the crazy part is, it's actually 8.30, my time, right? So I'm two hours, two hours ahead Dallas time. But man, I we basically I got 30 minutes of sleep last night. My first practice run, you get two four minute practice runs. There's so many people they end up shortening the practice time. It was originally five minutes practice. Now it's four minutes practice. My first practice run is at probably around 8:30. Then I got a meeting. Then I'll call. All right, we're charging. Look at this awesome charger wrap that I got from Mac Designs. Freaking amazing looking. What's up, man? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Can you okay, hear yeah, I was, on, I was on mute. Um, holy crap, man. 